Hello everyone, my name is Alyssa. In this video, this video is addressed to my twin flame Shia. Hi Shia. And for everyone who's watching, I thank you for watching, but this is going to be a, a lot of crime against me and my twin flame Shia. But Shia, I'm getting uh, tortured right now. I'm trying to use the ice pack. It's um... So, I'm going to read some things out from the notebook for you, Shia, and for those who's watching, I thank you for watching, however, um, not however, but if you write comments, I'm not going to respond to them, whether they're trying to be helpful or not. I'm not really looking at them either, or I'm, if I do look at them, it's going to be a long delay so that it doesn't trigger me in, in the time that the comment was sent. So, Shai, I know, I just want to remind you, Shai, I know that you've been abandoned. I know that you've been abandoned, Shai. You know, I don't think glasses is going to be a good thing for me. I tried to put on a little bit of the eyeliner to see what it would look like. It's actually an eye. I got that mascara. I didn't put on like extra foundation. I definitely am going to have to wear eye eyeliner in public because it makes me look better looking. And I do actually have to clean these glasses. I'm going to go right into the bathtub after this because it's been a long day, like extremely long, and I shouldn't have. So I'm going to make this video kind of short because I don't feel good. I'm actually feeling kind of sick. However, it made me really happy that there was one view. I know that the view that I get, they're still trying to trick me into thinking that you're not making the views. But I know that the view that I get that's very soon after I publish it is you because there's no one else that would actually do that. I know you've been abandoned, Shia, and it makes me sick. I can't, there's actually some things I just can't talk about. It makes me so sick. Because it doesn't matter whether I talk to you, which is not completely the way I want to talk to you. You're being abandoned because you can't be with me. My poor little baby's all locked away. My poor little baby shy is all locked away. So I'm gonna I have some OxyClean. I'm gonna try to wash my sneakers with OxyClean this week. I have a bunch of food that I have to cook. These past two days I have not been able to do Lumerian channeling. I've been too busy. I did um uh, So I'm going to stick with the notes because they're going to feed my thing, feed, feed things that I want to say. And they're like block me from thinking about things I have to do. This is on top of the brain injury that I have. So not so. I'm demonically possessed, Shia. I'm very, very tired. I'm going to try to 
be in a better mood. However, this uh, demon is just staring at me, pretending to be that criminal DW, like the, the whole two hours that I got back here and did that entire video. Very, very intimidating. So I only got six hours of sleep last night. I was rape tortured from forced one or probably two times. Rape tortured from about 1.30 a.m. to 5 a.m. Fell back, as fell asleep at 5 a.m. to 9.30. Realized that I was not getting to rape torture, so I fell back as so I was able to fall back asleep until like 10.30. So I got like six hours of sleep. This has been going on for three or four days now, only getting half a night's sleep. This has been going on for years, actually. I'm extremely sleep deprived. But the whole thing with this money spending too, if I get down to a very low amount of money, uh, the criminal DW and whoever else, uh, I'm assuming it's definitely my mother as well, they force me to feel like I'm a criminal because I don't have any money and I spent all my money and I'm like a drug addict with spending my money all at once. So I've been feeling, I've been forced to feel this way for a long time. Like I'm an addict with my money and I spend it all. So I'm like a criminal. I'm being illegal, spending all of my money at once. So I, I'm not going to go out for the rest of the month. I did spend most of my money, but it's things I had to get no matter what. And I did end up getting uh, you your Valentine's, Shia. And I just want to sh tell you that the, f the few things that I got for you is basically things that are for both of us, but definitely things I needed to get f before you got here so that you can feel comfortable because that's one thing I want you to feel is comfortable. There's not a single person on this planet, a single family member, that has ever made me feel comfortable. This, I can't say that this is complete comfort um, because the level of possession, the uh, low income because of the crime, that's the money theft that they have done to me. It's definitely not extreme comfort, however, this bed has definitely made my life so much better. Even when I like to like organize things, I can lay it out all in the bed. It's so much easier. So this bed, I'm so glad the telepathic supporters told me that you, you um, told, told them to tell me to get a bed the size for both of us. I think that also thought made me think that you were going to contact me very, very soon because you knew that we needed a bed. Extreme. Non-stop bitch sesh. Instead of saying session, S-E-S-S-S-E-S-S-I-O-N, the criminal DW starts fucking bitching, starts having a bitch sesh, like he's fucking cool saying sesh, he's a hipster, he's a cool hipster with all his hipster friends. I'm so sick of talking about these two criminals, however, you need to know, Shy, the extent of harassment, you need to know the amount of harassment this criminal has done to me. If I, it is not because I want to talk about these criminals. It is because the what they're doing to me. It is the amount of crime being done to me that you need to know about. 
And you need to know every little thing that this criminal is saying to me. And the other criminals are saying to me. So I did feel very sick this morning at 11 a.m. Didn't want to get out of bed. And this is also a constant thing they're doing with my brain injury. You know how I look a little different now with a brain injury? I have the face of a brain injured person. And the criminal DW is constantly throwing this in my face. Anytime I look in the mirror, look at you. You're dying. Look at your face. You're dying. That's the face of someone who's dying. So I put the limes in my, I put two limes because I thought it wasn't powerful enough and then I was getting sweaty in my underwear so then I put them in the, my, I wore a sport, this sports bra and I put the limes in the sports bra like so right here. I think it did do something and then in a couple hours in the morning when I went back to sleep in the, from I put them back in my underpants and my underwear. I don't say underpants. My underwear and I don't know if it's doing anything, but I'm going to stick with it still. I'm going to somehow put them on my body. It might not be comfortable enough to put it in your underwear, Shia, but if you find a place, the limes are supposed to suck out the negative energy. And then it's a demon killer weapon. And I'm, I'm very happy that you're watching. I'm very, very excited. I'm just so, I'm in such a bad mood. I'm in so much physical pain. I'm in so much physical pain. The criminal will attack. Oh yeah, this is what this criminal does. So if I have like, uh, if a criminal, the criminal DW is verbally assaulting me by saying something with a synthetic AI, uh, the criminal DW will use AI to make a muscle twitch or move or jolt and say, listen, listen to what I just said to you. And like he'll, he'll do a muscle jolt like, like from time to time. At least it happens at least a couple of times or a few times a day. I'll get a muscle twitch and that will, and then like everything will be quiet and silent and then listen to what I just said to you. This is pure psychotic, pure insanity. Pure this criminal DW is pure pure purely insane. You cannot do this to a human being and not this is the kind of evil criminal insane. It, it, this it, this is beyond insanity. What's happening to me? What has happened in my life? And they're they're uh, doing the uh, R A P E torture worse in this video to try to humiliate, and embarrass me, and make me stop the video. There's no uh, there's no kind of medication that would fix this type of psychotic insanity that these criminals are. Oh, I woke up to, not I woke up to, sometime today, this criminal DW says, you will always be a nobody. You will always be a nobody, Alyssa. Well, that's been told to me uh, at least in the millions of times over the course of 20 years through all the advertisements. 3.30 I am, 3.30 a.m. February 3. I'm the hero. You were supposed to die. The criminal DW says to me. It's exactly what it feels. Oh. A telepathic reporter told me last night, it's like this criminal DW with the subliminals and all the advertisements. He's literally eating eating my brain. He's literally. I was. He's he's literally 
eating my brain. It's eating it. The way the way the type of attack is. And this is like a rabid animal attacking Shy and Alyssa. And I was getting suffocated, I get shallow so when I get rape tortured I don't breathe well. I get very, very shallow breathing because if I breathe in too much, they make it wicked, wicked, wicked more intense and wicked more painful. And I, I'm always wondering, Shy, why the hell would the Lumerians let this happen to us? Why couldn't we just heal? Why couldn't we just be together? I guess there are, we are at dangerous levels of being near death and they've had to peel away at the onion, peel away at the onion. Dangerous levels of being near death, me and you, Shia, and they've had to peel away at the onion. So this criminal DW has pretend group, not pretend, this criminal DW has pretend group conversations with V2K telling me in my head, in my head, with voiced skull, this criminal W has pr imaginary conversations with uh, people that don't exist, but are, are forcing me to believe they exist. And like they're all taking turns attacking me. They're going around like a little powwow, just fucking verbally fucking assaulting me. And they're all taking turns, many turns. They're taking many turns. And, they, and he, he's always like acting like they're his buddies. They support him. They all want me to die. Yeah, I'm not going like that. Uh, and then, and then this was also something the Kremlin W said. I would eat her brain while she is alive if I could. The Kremlin W says I would I would eat Alyssa's brain while she's alive if I could. Well, for the type of torture that he gave me, uh, some telepathic supporters say this criminal deserves one M-I-L-L-I-O-N G-U-N space S-H-O-T-S to his head while he's alive as a torture penalty because over the course of 38 years I have gotten, I've received more pain than that. I've received more pain than that. And telepathic supporters are saying that. That that's what he's, well, that's not what he's going to get. He's going to get humiliated. I don't, I, he's going to get humiliated in prison. And by all the news channels finding out that this criminal was hacked into my computer for 15 years messing around with my electronics and there was nothing I could do about it. Not one single person wanted to help me, not one. Not one would try. They'd probably be threatened to be tortured. But they can torture the shit out of us nonstop 24-7. They're nobodies and they're fucking losers. They have no future existence. They're a species that's doesn't not supposed to exist. And there's different th there's a species, but there's different levels of criminal within the species. There's not millions of these criminal MGs and, and DWs all around the world. That's a fucking lie. This is, there is a, this planet is disgusting and is filthy. And basically I'm not even aware of the amount of crime and torture that happens on this planet. So now I'm gonna talk about you, Shia, because Let me pull up your video. Let me pull up your video. Ugh, burping up that Chipotle. <sighs> also, these cell phones and laptops, it really, there's some kind of witchcraft involved with when it gets down to 6% or when it gets down to 49%. I always get stressed out, nervous, and feel like 
it's like draining my energy like my, my there's a cord and it's like I'm the one that's like down to this specific percent I'm just not ha I'm not happy I'm not happy Shia there's no way around there's no way around it and I can't I can't go onto these videos and tell you that I'm happy I I'm one of the most brutally tortured people on this planet as well as you and I'm just sad. I wish I could cry. So these are things about Shia that I love about you, Shia. Shia, you're a thinker. You're very intelligent. And you have spirit guides that are helping you. I know this. You were very grateful and thankful that you found me, Shy, and I I've had the I have had the greatest sense of relief knowing who you are and how, that I finally met my twin flame and had future husband and husband. I know you have. You're very cautious. You, you. I know that you do have anxiety. I know that you're not materialistic like me. You're very centered and balanced. I can't imagine the amount of pain that you're in with your body, especially your genitals. I can't imagine it. They just did that, like, grabbed a wicked heart in my eye. You're a victim of crime. Imagine, come on. Imagine them walking around like human beings with friends and family and support and money. Yeah, right. It's all over for them, Shia. When they get locked up in jail, we're going to be in paradise, Shia. We're going to be in paradise. So I know that you have a very pleasing personality and are a deep thinker. You're very enthusiastic and expressive. I know you have a very sincere heart. And I know none of these things mean anything when you're getting tortured. You get so you just feel sick. You just feel like collapsing. And they're giving me some of the most severe pain right now that I feel like I'm going to pass out and I can't think. That's why I'm acting like this right now. But that was fake tears. I'm not allowed to cry. So don't think that that happens to me at all. That never happens to me. I'm not, I'm not even allowed to make tears. I'm not able to make tears. And it was almost like a form of torture when I couldn't cry and they, when, they, when they were telling me with AI, we're allowing you to cry when we want you to. So I think right now what you have to do, Shy, right now is just to protect yourself. Protect yourself? What the fuck are you talking about? So, I'm going to actually um, go in the bathtub and do the Lumerian channeling. Uh, I can't just keep saying I have had a long day excuse. And I'm already coming up, they're already coming up with the, the plan that 
I'm going to be too busy cooking tomorrow. So this type of uh, pain that I'm receiving right now, I'm going to do something about it. And when I go in the water with my bathing suit, uh, that's when they get. Um, that's when I get the most deactivation happening. So I would just just know, Shia, that we're going to be together soon. And I know that we're going to be together soon. That's why I'm staying very hopeful. I'm looking at myself in the other camera and I look awful. I actually want to stay in this. This is too detailed. This is showing... So I'm going to end this video and I'm going to go do the Lumerian channeling. And because this, um, because I know that the whole, it gives um, both of us, Shia, when we do the Lumerian channeling, it tells these little uh, parasitic bugs, criminals, that they're not powerful, that we are the powerful ones. So I'll, I'll have a, a better video tomorrow with more notes and I really wanted to see more things in this video but I think I have to I, I have to I have to do what I have to do with the Lumerian channeling uh, and it's getting late tonight. So I'm going to go do that. So I'm not going to tell tell you what time and what hour. I was doing the Lumerian channeling, walking back and forth in the middle of the morning when I was getting tortured. I said, no. No, I'm not going to just get tortured. I spent a whole month off with the Lumerian channeling, going to the oceans, and I feel like they were getting a lot of uh, confidence from me. Like I was never going to do any of my Lumerian channeling again. So, Shai, I know that you're, you're probably not feeling well like me. And I'm having a very bad... I had a very bad day. I ran around and... Like, the demon portal is so strong. They just fill my basket. I have to literally, like, put go into an aisle and put things away and say, no, I can't. No, I can't. <laughs> that face is not what I'm supposed to be looking like. They've, they're trying to make me look uglier than I am. This criminal all day long makes fun of me uh, that I'm so poor. And that's not what I just did. This is not power, just so you know. And you have no future existence to whoever's remote viewing me and listening to me. You have no future existence. You're a creature, a demonic creature that knows that you have no future existence and you were born with no future existence. Don't worry, Shy. we're not going to die. I'm told this hundreds of thousands of times a day, all day long, that I'm going to die. And that I'm going to get murdered. And that I'm near, so near death that I'm not going to make it. I even have moments during the night and day when they give me the stroke symptoms that I'm not going to make it. And I know this is happening to you. And you have... Um, I know I say this every time. I'm going to talk more about you. I'm going to talk more about you. What happens with the, the demon portal with my money? I'm going to save my money. I'm going to save my money.
someone, someone's having a good time with AI right now. And I've seen the way people react with me and talking back at me, like in public or something. They're AI. They're AI. There's no way they could come up with a thought that quick. There's no way. So, Shy, I just want you to know. Let me use the pen. Someone's trying controlling this the whole past 10 minutes. Someone's been trying to control what I'm saying to you right now, Shia. Ooh, you're powerful. Why don't you get a fucking life? Get out of my fucking business. Get out of my fucking life. You fucking losers. Oh, my life is stealing Alyssa's life and Shia's life. That's my life. I know that you're not being heard. However, you are being heard because I write notes all day long. Telepathic supporters are telling me some of your thoughts and things that you're thinking. You are being heard by me. However, I'm not allowed to dream about you. So I know for a fact my, I'm completely possessed and my, my mind is blocked because I can't even have dreams about you. Very, very rare. Never have actually seen your actual body. In my and face in my dreams, not once. That is not a lie. So don't worry, Shia. Tomorrow will be a better video. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Thank you so much, Shia, for watching. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Thank you so much, Shai, for watching.